Which letter in the list of names for hurricanes gets retired the most? Well, in order to get our answer, let's first dive into the list of names itself. 21 letters are used for names each season. Wait, but there are 26 letters in the alphabet. You're correct. Q, U, X, Y, and Z are not used. Well, how come? It's simple, really. There just aren't that many names that begin with those letters. Now, there are six lists of names used to identify tropical storms and hurricanes. They are on a six-year rotation. This is 2024's list. Now, do you think you know the answer to the question above? Which letter of the 21 that are used gets retired the most? It's the letter I. In fact, names beginning with the letter I have been retired 13 times. Most recently, Ian in 2022 after devastating Southwest Florida. Remember, names are retired from the list if they were so deadly or destructive that any future use of the name would be considered insensitive. So what is it about the I names? Well, there's actually a fairly straightforward possibility as to why we see so many I names going into retirement. Let's take a look at climatology. According to records from the National Hurricane Center, the I name storm or the ninth name storm of the season typically develops on or around September 16th. Remember that date. What else is around the middle of September? The peak of the hurricane season occurs on or around September 10th. Ideal conditions that make dangerous storms more likely are present during this time, putting the odds that an I named storm would be one that is a higher chance at bringing about damage and loss of life if it were to make landfall. Now, in this year's list, the I name is Isaac. Will Isaac be one to remember? Time will tell. For 13 News Now, I'm Chief Meteorologist Tim Pandagis.